Thank you. Praise the Lord. Time pastor him, you know, stop him acting pastor. Okay, call him him acting pastor. Time pastor him, you know, stop. He may me protocol. Praise the Lord. He acting pastor, blood church. Praise the Lord. Thank you, acting pastor. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Well, me enjoy worship this morning. Praise the Lord. Presence of God is table of bless you this morning. Oh, hallelujah. Why not give one people a hand, Lord Master? Oh, hallelujah. Bible blow me, no one the mobile. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Testimonies. Lord, brother. Yes, Mr. God, he make him full of something, Lord Island, Lord Ambrem. Island, Lord Fire. Praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. Who will like him fire? Praise the Lord. You may everyone in me suit desire blow star blow place blow fire. So this morning, but you may have small about fire. Praise the Lord. Me believe all mama. Only in time time look at the yesterday. Only kakai to mas lap lap. That is why I come the morning look listen. Me look all this quiet. Only no sabi move from too much lap lap. And me too, me enjoy him lap lap well, he Praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Well, suppose you got Bible blow you with them you this morning. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. You turn them with them me. Do a known scripture. You want them read with them you me this morning. Praise the Lord. Book of Acts. Fire is tablo book of Acts. <laughs> Acts chapter number one. We believe that Pentecost Sunday him next week. 
Next Sunday. But hey, me good blow, you may start feeling Pentecost. Start now. Acts chapter number one, verse five. Hemi talam lo yumi olsem. Talk to Luke. Hemi talam lo yumi olsem. For John truly baptized with water, but ye shall be baptized with the Holy Ghost not many days hence. But even I baptize with the Holy Ghost in a long time. Praise the Lord. We also want them to read Acts chapter number 2, verse 4. The first four, and they were all filled with the Holy Ghost and began to speak with other tongues as the Spirit gave them utterance. Lord Jesus, we will tell them thank you to you this morning. We will praise them and pray you. Me will exalt them you this morning because me will have a feeling power play you. Me will have a feeling presence play you, God, in our midst this morning. And so, Lord, me will want them to tell them thank you, you, God. That by you continue, God, Lord, let them spirit play you, Jesus. And me lead him, me will have. And me guide them, me will have, God. Lord Jesus, the way where you, you want them. We will pray this morning. We dedicate this service unto you. We dedicate this worship unto you. We dedicate, oh God, Dr. Blue, you unto you this morning, Lord Jesus. You bless them, Dr. Blue, you. Anoint your word, Lord Jesus. Oh God, Lord. Oh Father, we pray, God, by you continue. God, bless you bless them, Mivala. In Jesus' wonderful name, we will stop humbly pray. Amen, amen, amen. Praise the Lord. Bless the Lord. You may be seated. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Well, me, me tell them thank you, Lord God. Lord, you may everyone, we have a stop, Lord God, this morning. Uh, thank you, Lord. Pastor, let me not stop attacking, let me stop, Lord. Full beat, Lord, this morning. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Me glad to, Lord, Pastor, let me take a break. And let me go, let me visit your family. Praise the Lord. Amen. Me think say me will more plan block out lo me visit him family plan. Praise the Lord. Me think say time him is straight. Lo him go. Praise the Lord. You me give me one break. Lo him is away go and visit him all families. Hallelujah. Also brother Ricky him rightly tell him me spend them so much time blah him lo you me. Praise the Lord. So he need a little bit of time to spend them with them family blah. Praise the Lord. Well this morning me want them. Since Timblo Yumi, Pastor Hemi, and me put him one Timblo Yumi, and me tell him the Holy Spirit in the church, or the Holy Spirit and salvation. And me, me team where Pastor Hemi put him Lo Yumi. And so this morning, me, me want them speak. Lo one small thing, thing also, the Holy Spirit is for the church. The Holy Spirit is for the church. You saw a Bible, let me tell them long you me, and we sing about it this morning. You may serve one God where he me holy. God is holy. 1 Peter 1, 16, let me tell them, be a holy for I am holy. So we serve and believe in a God that is a holy God. Nature block God, he me holiness. He me one righteous God. And so, Bible, let me also tell them long you me that holiness God let me also a spirit. God let me one spirit. John 4 24, me tell them long you me. God is a spirit. So, tell me a holy spirit. Okay? Holy spirit. God let me spirit, let me holy. So that them, holy spirit. Praise the Lord. Because God, we have his spirit and have his holy. And so we are sinners. Yes? Give me everyone, give me, we are sinners. So blow meet him righteous requirement, blow God, or meet him standard, blow God. Hallelujah. So that God accept him, you me, low level, blah. 
you may need to be born again. Amen? Praise the Lord. That's one of you may stop making. That is why you must repent from sins. And you may need to baptize the name of Jesus for the remissions of our sins. And you must baptize with the Holy Ghost. So that you may spend the eternity with him God where he is holy. And you may save him the day of Jesus. Now, the term Holy Ghost or Holy Spirit let me refer to him something. Praise the Lord. These are titles to emphasize God's holiness and God's spiritual nature. Praise the Lord. New Testament, let me associate or let me link him work with God, the life, the man, or the work with the Holy Spirit. Let me one aspect of work with God, the life, the man. Praise the Lord. Holy Spirit. Amen. Hallelujah. Let me demonstrate them God in activity. God is the work of life, the man. Praise the Lord. So New Testament, let me associate or let me try and blow. Tell them that you may say, work the Holy Spirit, the life, the man. Let me blow, regenerate them. Life, the you may. More dwell and live inside, the you may. So time you may stop talk about, talk, talk, yeah. regenerate. You mean him one of them. You mean him. Say, God, let me, let me, let me come inside the man, breathe him one new life. Breathe new life into man. You may revive. Let me try restore. You see something where me dead. Let me exist, but let me dead. You need him one revival. You need him to want something, he come, he revive him. You need him want something, blow me, make him, let me restore, let me bring back to life. Praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. So that man can become like God. Work the Holy Spirit, the life, the man. Let me help him, man, to change. He save him, man. He mold him life, the man. So that man is having meet him standard for God. Praise the Lord. You imagine you look in one track where he may rotate and he may not walk maybe because of one accident. He sleep his stuff. You carry him with a courage. Only change him will. Only change him all parts. Only paint him good. Then only carry him with a public works. But only check him say he wrote what Praise the Lord. Only carry me go public works. Track it chains. Blow check him say me wrote what he. So that public works is have a qualify him say yes. Track here me what he blow run the road. Praise the Lord. So after public works he check him. He looks say straight. He make him one paper. You go customs. You pay him one sticker. Stick up the road tax. Blow you have a run the road. Praise the Lord. Walk the Holy Spirit, the life, the one man, and me all say me now. Praise the Lord. You me, you me weak. You me, you me human beings. You me flesh and blood. So walk the Holy Spirit. He come, the life, the man, the make him kind of walk here now. All chains. He paint them good you. He mold them good you. He save them good you. Oh, hallelujah. Blow meet him standard. Blow life of holiness where God them require him. We all need the Holy Ghost. The church needs the Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. We cannot achieve God's standard without, without human effort. Praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. That is why the baptism of the Holy Spirit is for the church. Hallelujah. Have me one final New Testament experience with God. 
Jesus said, Mitalem, Acts chapter number one, verse five. You may read him this morning. Yes, I'll be baptized with the Holy Ghost. Not many days hence. You see, let me just talk to Glopita. You build the church. Upon this rock, I will build the church. But before the church will be established, wait for the power. Luke 24, 49. And behold, I send the promise of the Father upon you. But there he in the city of Jerusalem until you are endured with power from on high. So when Jesus is telling them, talk, talk, you have to be resurrected from the dead. That's why I'm telling you, not many days since, ten days after. And when the day of Pentecost was fully come. They were all in one accord. In one place. And suddenly. Something like a rushing mighty wind. Holy Spirit them in a wind. But it's something like that. It filled all the house where they were sitting. You see, all people only stop inside the one place, but it filled the house. And it filled everything that is in the house. It filled the house where they were sitting. Something like fire. Something like fire. Lot of blockheads blow all. But Holy Ghost is not fire. But it's something like that. And Bible, let me tell you. And all, all they were all filled with the Holy Ghost. All. All. You see? All is the house, the full map house. Everything in the house, let me full map. You might see one container, he empty. Put some water, he go inside. Not only water, he me full map container, but every surrounding block container. Oh, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. You see the word baptism, you be running me means immersion. Deep. That's the word baptism. But Jesus said, tell him, look at that. You shall be baptized with the Holy Ghost. Time you may go under the water, Lord, name, Lord Jesus, you may go under. You come from up, you may. But Pap the same of the Holy Ghost, you have to be immersed in the Spirit. Spirit, it must full up you. You have to be full, full of it. You have to be full of it. Oh, hallelujah. You see, John chapter number four. Conversation to Jesus with the woman summary. John chapter number four. Suppose I deserve a suitum. John chapter number four. John chapter number four, verse 13. First 13, let me tell him, Jesus answered and said unto her, that's woman Samaria. Whosoever drinketh of this water shall taste again. Next verse. But whosoever drinketh of the water that I shall give him shall never taste. 
shall never thirst, but the water that I shall give him shall be in him. The water that I shall give him shall be in him. Water when by me be given shall be in him. By stop inside the ham. By stop inside the ham. By stop inside the ham. By full map him. And by stop to spring up. He spring up or someone well. Hallelujah. He spring up. He spring up. Until he come come sight. By come come sight. Time he come come sight people by hear him sound. Time he come come sight people by hear him sound. People by look. People by hear him. Because what they have me, you also want well. Let me boil, let me boil, let me boil, and then let me come outside. Oh, hallelujah. Shall be in him. A well of water springing into everlasting life. So time. Jesus, let me talk to long Acts chapter 1 verse 5. He stopped telling long you me say you shall be filled with the Holy Ghost. You must be full, filled, and full up the Holy Ghost as a church. This is supposed to be an experience, a lifestyle, an apostolic experience of the church. Put it Christ. You as an individual born again believer, you have to be filled with the Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. The experience. Hallelujah. Baptism of the Holy Spirit. Let me describe one man who received this experience of filled with the Spirit of God. One of me just read him now. Yeah. Let me stop talk about. Let me stop describe him. Somebody will experience him. Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. What's the middle of today? Time one container. Let me full up the water. Let me go. Let me full up. Only full up water. Coco, you full up. Not only that container. Let me surrounded by, by water. But also container. Let me full up with them water. This illustration. Let me indicate them. Look at me. That the idea that a person may receive him Holy Spirit, he may achieve, achieve him one personal union with God. Time God, let me full map you with them spirit man. You know what? You are connected with God. You got one union with God. You got one relationship with God. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. God, let me unite them, you with them. God, let me join them, you with them. That person lives a constant, continuous, unchanging, faithful contact with God. And you know what? God becomes part of his everyday life. God becomes part of his everyday life. That person becomes a temple in which God dwells. And the spirit of God, have we got one impact? Look at everyday life, Blam. Everyday thoughts, Blam. Everyday walk about, Blam. Everyday action, Blam. So that time is have a thing straight. So that they may walk about straight. So that they may act straight. So that they may behave straight. Damn Jesus. Let me give him commission long old disciples. And I sent the promise of my father upon you. But there ye in the city of Jerusalem. Until ye be endured with power from on high. And so Bible let me tell them. Long you me. See as they wait for the promise of the Holy Ghost. 
when the day of Pentecost was fully come. They receive it. They receive it. They were all filled with the Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. This is supposed to be an apostolic experience. The baptism of the Holy Ghost belongs to the church. You should claim it. It belongs to you. It's your possession. It's an asset that you own. Oh, hallelujah. It's supposed to be something that the church should be longing to have. Suppose you don't got any something, Lord Walia, but long to have the Holy Ghost. You have to learn to have the Holy Ghost. So she stopped, Lord Walia, you travel, you don't got any something, but long to have the Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. 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 It's a promise. And it's a free gift. It's a free gift. Anyone can have it. Yes. We need to witness. Get people to church. We teach them to repent of their sins. Then we baptize them. In the name of Jesus for the remission of your sins. But we also need to help them. To receive the baptism of the Holy Ghost. We also need to help them receive the baptism of the Holy Ghost. That is essential for salvation. Someone's salvation is not complete. Your repentance and baptism in Jesus' name. For the remission of sins. God, we must send him salvation here. God, we must confirm him salvation here. God, we must qualify him. Approve him. Stamp him. Salvation here. God, he must approve him. God, he must qualify him. God, he must stamp him. Time God, let me fool my view with them spirit of him. Or you baptize. The baptism of the Holy Spirit. You are sealed with the Holy, Holy Spirit of promise. You are sealed. You are stamped. You are approved. Oh, hallelujah. God stamp. He must stop on you. God seal, he must stop on you. Hallelujah. Oh, you say me time, God, let me put them stamp on you. Let me stop making one town payment. Let me stop putting one deposit. Let me stop giving me one guarantee. No one something you are about to possess. Heaven is a place we all want to go. We need all the requirements to go there. We need to have a ticket. We need a passport. We also need a visa. Suppose you want them to travel to Australia, you need one even or two ticket, but you also need a passport. But you also need Australian visa to enter Australia. From maybe one different country. And we got requirements, Blam. To go to heaven, it has its own requirements. You may must repent, you may must baptize the name of Jesus. But you may must ensure that we are sealed with the Holy Spirit of promise. You saw John 3 5. Jesus said, Talk to Glonica Thomas. Except a man be born again of the water, but the minus top of but of the spirit. He cannot enter the kingdom of heaven.
Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You may need to baptize the Holy Ghost. You may need to seal. You may need to storm. You may need to get him approval for God. God, let me must come and approve of salvation for you. Book of Acts, let me describe him. Baptism of the Holy Ghost in no different ways. Acts chapter 2, verse 4, me tell him, only filled with the Holy Ghost. Acts chapter 2, verse 33, me tell him, the promise of the Holy Ghost. Acts 2, 38, me tell him, the gift of the Holy Ghost. Acts 10, 44, me tell him, the, the Holy Ghost fell on all of them. Acts 10, 47, me receive the Holy Ghost. Acts 19, 6, me tell him, the Holy Ghost came on them. You see all these different expressions, phrases, and we identify the same New Testament experience in different ways. Time one empty human vessel, he baptized the spirit. Have me filled with the spirit here now. Time God, have me pour him out spirit for him. No man, spirit for God, he come for him. Have me receive him spirit for God. Let me feel with him spirit, Lord God. Time God, let me give him spirit, Lord him, Lord man. God, let me fulfill him promise, Lord him, and man, let me receive him spirit, Lord him. Oh, hallelujah. So the baptism of the Holy Ghost, he must come part, Lord lifestyle, Lord church. Will I remind him tell him? He must come part, Lord lifestyle, Lord church. Oh, the church has to be a Holy Ghost church. It has to be a Holy Ghost driven, Holy Ghost leading, Holy Ghost guidance. It has to be a Holy Ghost walking, Holy Ghost worship, Holy Ghost praise, Holy Ghost dance, Holy Ghost music, Holy Ghost everything. Sometimes after Pentecost, a number of spirit baptized believers only come together for a prayer meeting. And the Bible says they were all filled with the Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. These believers already only receive the Holy Ghost on the day of Pentecost. Pentecost did this pass. Only the receiving Holy Ghost. Just few, few days. But only come for a meeting. And then Bible let me tell them, say, the Holy Ghost fill everyone. Oh, hallelujah. These believers already experienced the baptism of the Holy Ghost. But God, let me want them to renew their initial experience. God, let me just want them to renew him. Experience what he got yesterday. So that today you'll have got another chance. Time Peter, let me stop talk talk to one. Jewish religious council. You have a lame man located beautiful, let me just hit. Only can remember me, go to temple. Bible, let me tell him, Lord, Acts 4, verse 8, let me tell him, say, he was filled with the Holy Ghost. Wow. Man, it is full of no the Holy Ghost, not the Pentecost, it is preached. But here again. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. You saw me then, Paul. Let me prophesy, go to one sorcerer, one witchcraft man. Name them by Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. Let me, let me prophesy to him, say, by me blind for a while. Bible, let me tell him, you me, say, he was full of the Holy Ghost. That's Paul. 
You saw me on seven deacons when you appointed Molkata. Blow help them all apostles. Bible, let me tell them, say, they were full. They were men full of the Holy Ghost. But remember, you got the initial experience, Felicia. Already, they already filled with the Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. You saw me, Paul, let me encourage them. Church long Ephesians. Ephesians 5, 18. To be filled with the Spirit. Look at me, encourage them, church. Continue to be filled with the Spirit. Oh, hallelujah. What am I now? One story and I stop telling them, you mean? You stop telling them, Lord, church. What am I now? Stop telling them, Lord, church. Oh, hallelujah. I believe that the apostolic church is supposed to be a Holy Ghost church. I believe that the Holy Ghost church it should be a constant apostolic. It should get experience. That experience of the Holy Ghost. You must continue inside the church. Oh. Church needs constant, continuous renewal of the Holy Ghost. You must get one quickening in the spirit. You see, time you feel weak. Time you feel you run out of strength. That's when you need the revival. You need something in your spirit. You need something to stir you up. Oh. Oh. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And so this morning, if we're an apostolic church, the experience of the baptism of the Holy Ghost is for us. The early church only got one experience of a constant infilling of the Holy Ghost. Give me this go through now. It's not a one-time experience. You hear me? It's not a one-time experience. Suppose you receive him, Lord, 2,000. That's not the end of it. You can be refilled. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. It's not a one-time experience. Oh, hallelujah. Suppose to be one-time experience. Hallelujah, no more. Peter, I am not refilled with the Holy Ghost. Suppose to be a one-time experience. The church members will be refilled. But you know, refilled with the Holy Ghost. Suppose to be one-time experience. Paul, but you know, refilled with the Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. Because it is not a one-time experience. It's supposed to be a lifestyle of the apostolic church. It's supposed to be part of its culture. Last scripture, blew you me. Acts chapter 19. I think Sutum Acts 19. Let me know one, one, let me one well-known scripture. Acts 19, verse 1. You're right, a little is low. Okay. Acts 19, and it came to pass, that's Paul, that while Apollos was at Corinth, Paul, having passed through the upper coast, came to Ephesus and finding certain disciples. Praise the Lord. Next one. <coughs> he said unto them, have you received the Holy Ghost since you believed? Wow, that's an important question. One important question for believers. One important question for people when he's born again. Have you received the Holy Ghost since you believe? Have you received the Holy Ghost since you repent, you baptize in Jesus' name? Important question for us today. Have you received the Holy Ghost? Because it's an important question. Am I essential for your salvation? That's why we need to ask. Have you received the Holy Ghost since you believe? Have you received the Holy Ghost since you stay in church for too long? Oh, hallelujah. 
And so this morning, me believe that an apostolic church is supposed to have the Holy Ghost. Me believe that an apostolic church, and me must have an importance for baptism for the Holy Ghost. Because it's essential for our salvation. We need to long for that. And so this morning, before you may finish, we want to ask them, suppose you have been baptized with the Holy Ghost. Or suppose you've been baptized with the Holy Ghost, but have you been renewed? Have you been refilled with the Holy Ghost? Hallelujah. Everyone stand this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. As all sing and so lily the mumilo and chorus this morning, me want them open them altar so that everyone got opportunity. Look, um, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. As all sing and so lily the mumilo and chorus this morning, me just open up altar this morning. Suppose you feel so you need him, Holy Ghost. Why, Terry? Why you tarry? Why wait? You can receive it now. Oh, hallelujah. Don't wait for Pentecost next Sunday. You can receive it today. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Suppose you think say you need to one re re renewal this morning. Just come, just come, just come. Whosoever will let him come this morning. Oh, hallelujah.